welcome to Midtown Assisted Living. How may I help you? Well, finally, we made it to the bar. Give me two shots of Chevitz and two Long Island iced teas. Chop, chop! No, Grandma. This is not a bar. It's a nursing home. That's a receptionist, not a bartender. Then why does she look like a stripper, Charlie? Oh, I'm sorry. She means no offense. She's just a little confused is all. Are you here to check in? This is my grandmother, Eloise McCutcheon. Let me get Dr. Shepard to help you get situated. Why don't you check in and I'll notify him that you're here. Dr. Shepard? No, Granny, you know you can't drink in this building. Ah, uh, hell, kid. I'm 82 years old. I haven't been laid in 50 years. Oh, not now. Can't a girl have some fun? Uh, 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 welcome, welcome. I'm Dr. Jack Shepard. It's very nice to meet you. I'm the resident physician here at Midtown Assisted Living. And it's my job to tend to this beautiful young lady for the duration of her visit here. Get your filthy hands away from me, you quack. Oh, well, uh, <clears throat> shall we show you to your new home away from home? Well, tell me how you came to choose assisted living for your grandmother. Well, because what happened when... I can tell you why. These wretched kids have been trying to lock me away in this hell hole since they first met me. Ella, that is not... What Don't even get me started with you, Missy. You've been trying to get my condo on the beach ever since you first met me. The thing is, Doctor, we tried to have her stay with us, but she scares away our visitors. She burns holes in the furniture with her cigarettes. We can't even let her live on her own anymore because she can't take care of herself. I see. Well, You'll be happy to know that most of the patients that are here have family that are going through the exact same predicament that you are. And I know that it's a very hard decision to make, but I think it's the right one. I know, Granny. You might meet some new friends and do some new activities. Should be fun. This is what I think about your experience. Oh. Oh. Damn, woman! What's your problem? I think we're going to have to sedate her. Uh, it's just for the safety of all the other patients and, and the rest of the staff. Nurse Kate. Yes, Doctor. Would you please escort Miss Eloise to her room? And uh, would you please administer two milligrams of Xanax? Certainly. Thank you very much. Oh, dear. No, no. No, it's all right. I'll make you pay for this if it's the last thing I ever do. Well, it was very nice meeting you. I, I really don't want you to worry about your grandmother. She's going to be fine here. She's in very good hands. Thank you. So glad we put that old bitch in here. Uh, now we can use her credit cards, her money, 